Today we are headed to Target. My daughter's third birthday is coming up and I'm so excited. But I wanted to take you guys to Target with me today and see what we can find. Of course, we are going to browse down the home aisle. I came across these picnic blankets by Hearth and Hand, which I thought were a really great price. They're $34.99. It's a really good size too, but I thought these were a cute little find. So in case you guys are looking for picnic blankets for the summer or 4th of July to go to the beach, definitely check out these ones at Hearth and Hand. This Target did have a handful of these new faux like thyme and rosemary plants, and I thought these would be really cute i actually really need one for my girl's room because their real plant actually died so anyways but i did take a good scroll down the hearth and hand aisle a lot of really good kitchen items i love their wooden glass trays i also found these trays as well these were actually 12.99 but i thought these would be really great for like an outdoor serving trays or um, you know catering platters or party platters if you guys host guests over the summer that would be a really cute tray to serve up your food so then I found these really cute mugs these were $3.99 I thought that was a really great deal I really like the size of them but what was really cute are these Dutch ovens like what I love the mini Dutch ovens I think these are so adorable a little expensive they're $14.99 for one so obviously even if he needs six they're gonna add up pretty quickly but but nonetheless, I thought these would be great to do like peach cobbler or maybe some like apple crisp in it. Um, anyways, really cute. I actually really love those. Um, yeah, just some cute coffee mugs. I also found the new Studio McGee, one of their planter um, pots. Um, I really like it. I haven't seen it in person yet, so this was the first time. I really like them. A really good price too, $29.99 for the large pot. Um, super cute. I like the white texture on it. Um, and yeah, a good old pompous candle. I did snag two of these. They're only $12.99. Hands down, the best scent at Target. No lie. So anyways, I did grab two of those candles and they had some baskets and some wreaths, but not anything I was really loving. I did come across this storage box at Target, $24.99. I actually, um, I believe there's a smaller one as well, but I think those would be really great layering pieces for like a bookshelf or a bookcase. And then they had some other new bathroom items. Um, I did want to check out Casa Luna because they have some really great candles and scents as well. They use a lot of essential oils in their products, which make their aromas really nice and fragrant. Um, the Clarity scent though is my personal favorite. I did come across this oil diffuser, which I've never seen at Casa Luna. Um, I believe they probably have had it for a while, but um, I did find these and they also have some essential oils. I thought the sleep blend would be interesting to try. I didn't pick it up for today's um, Target run, but it is on my list of items to try out. I headed down the children's aisle to find some good toys. I am going to snag a handful of these Play-Dohs because my daughter absolutely loves it. She can spend hours in the kitchen just playing with this stuff. So I know she's going to love some new Play-Doh. I also saw this KitchenAid which I thought would be really cute for her. She loves to bake. She loves cooking with me. So I feel like this would be a really good little gift for my three-year-old. Um, I just want to show you guys how crazy my Target is. Like this is probably the messiest I've ever seen this Target. I don't know what happened, but it looked like a tornado just like blew through every single aisle. It was absolutely nuts. Anyways, I do like this brand at Target. Because I feel like their toys are actually really good quality. A little bit, um, like they're priced a little bit higher, but not by much. So anyways, I do like this brand. Whenever I am at Target and my kids want toys, I typically check out this brand first. Um, yeah, this is the Disney aisle. You guys, look at this. This is freaking crazy. Um, I ended up picking up my daughter some jammies. I do love the fact that Target carries Burt's Bees. I feel like their jammies are the best fitting. I love the snug fit. But however, they only had long sleeve jammies. I did find this pair, which I thought was really cute. The purple and the little animals. She loves animals. Also found this romper which I feel like was a really great find. Um, I'm not in love with a lot of Target's clothes for girls. Um, I just kind of feel like they don't really have 
I don't know, the best selection. They did have a handful of these little summer sets though, which I think would be great for after the pool or just on like a really hot day. Um, but I love outfits that come in a set. I feel like it's just super easy. Of course, you know, you know, I went down the lounge aisle for myself because mama needs a new pair of jammies. Um, I also just took, um, I also came across this little cute sundress I thought was really fun for summer, pretty affordable. And I will say Target does have pretty good like beach woven baskets for, you know, something you could throw the towels, the snacks in, diapers and all of that. So anyways, this bag is probably my favorite find at Target for this summer. I did buy one last year that I still have and it is in good shape. I just got back from Target and I wanted to show you guys what I ended up picking up. Excuse the hair. I know my head's like kind of cut off, but it's a big, it's a big bun kind of hair day today before i left today i told my husband i was like i think i'm gonna go to the other target that's like a 45 minute drive and he was like why would you drive that far and i was like because it's so much better anyways decided not to do that today and just go to the one that's closer to my house you guys i literally hate going to that target i don't know why i do it it's awful every time also it's the biggest mess like it looked like a tornado just flew through the store it was so messy <sighs> anyways i want to show you guys what i picked up not a lot actually i didn't i didn't pick up any home stuff besides the candles um because it's not why i went today but i will show you what i got for my daughter's little third birthday she's turning three and i'm so excited um that's coming up next week but i want to show you guys what i ended up snagging her um at target and it was I ended up actually finding some pretty cute stuff. So I ended up grabbing her these little jammies for summertime because obviously um, the long sleeves aren't gonna work. We've had long sleeve jammies for winter time, but obviously we need some short sleeves. So I actually found this two pair pack of jammies for her. Um, and this, you guys, is only $4. I actually couldn't believe it. She was like, wow, I only really see that. The Originally, they are $16.99. And when they rang up $4, I was like, is that correct? And she was like, yeah. She's like, that only happens when they're clearancing them out and they're no longer carrying the style anymore. So this was like the biggest score of today's shopping trip to Target. They were only, it's pretty much like they were $2 a set. That's like such a steal. So anyways, I picked her up some new jammies. Um, cause she like really needs them and she's been growing so fast that like I buy her new jammies and then the next thing I know they're shrunk, they're too short. Anyway, it's time for a bigger size. I did find her this cute little romper, which I love putting my girls in rompers. I find that's just so easy. It's a one set. You just throw it on. It looks cute. It's done. You don't have to worry about shorts and a top and blah, blah, blah. It's just like a nice little one piece that's cute. It's stylish. So I found her this one. It's $12. This is by Cat and Jack. I will say that if I'm being honest, Target selection for girls clothes is not the best. I feel like Target has a better boy selection than they do girls, just my opinion. So I typically don't really find my girls great clothes at Target, um, but obviously today I did find them like a, cu a few cute uh, things, but I really like H&M's girl selection for clothes. H&M and Zara I feel like have the best girl selection and for boys too. So anyways, I typically get my kids clothes from there, but today I did find this cute little romper um, I love the green. I think it's so cute for summer. And then I also picked up a cute little summer set because we are going on vacation. We're going to Hawaii in September and then we're also going um, down to St. George a few times. So I'm, And it's like super, super hot. So I did pick her up this cute little watermelon set, which I think would be great for like after the pool, change them on, change them out of their swimsuit. This was $15 for the set and I thought that was cute. Summery. She's gonna be nice and cool in this. So anyways, that was a good little find at Target as well. And then I also picked her up, this really cute, fun sundress. I typically like to match my girls while I can <laughs> before they have their own opinions of what they wanna wear. So, um, but I did find this little dress. I do get her the, the 
extra small. It's a four to five. Um, and this was only $15 and I thought it was a cute little sundress for summer. And I like putting the little biker shorts on underneath. So that way, you know, they're still modest, um, but they're nice and cool on top. So I thought that was a cute little sundress. I think she's really going to like. I did snag myself. I did go down the lounge, uh, aisle for myself and I found this lounge set which I already showed you guys in the video but I got this in a size large because your girl's got a big booty so I get these in a the large plus I like my loungewear to be a little oversized like nice and baggy I don't like things to be like clung to me <laughs> in terms of like my lounge clothes so anyways got this in a set I like the buttons um, on the little shorts it also has like a little ruffles on the bottom but this was what was the price of this this was only $21.99 so I thought that was a pretty good deal um, and yeah it's just like a nice lounge set to wear at home and comfy cozy but still cool for summertime all right so for her little toys I ended up picking up um, some Play-Doh sets because she absolutely loves Play-Doh. What's funny is growing up, I hate, like, I hate Play-Doh. I hate the smell of it. It's, like, messy. It's really the smell that bothers me. Um, but my kids absolutely... <laughs> They love Play-Doh. So I picked her up this new little set. It's like this KitchenAid. I thought it would be really cute. She loves to help cook in the kitchen. So I thought she would love a little Play-Doh version of a KitchenAid with some Play-Doh. So I picked this up and I also grabbed her, I don't know, four or five different little Play-Doh um, to, you know, play with. So I picked up a few of those in a handful of different colors. And then she loves dress up. Like she... She is my girly girl. She loves dress up, especially as princesses. We're very serious in this house. So I picked her up a cute little set like this. I believe this was like $19.99. All of their Disney stuff is like way more expensive because it's Disney. But it's, um, you know, cute little crown shoes and a little wand because every little three-year-old wants a princess wand. So I grabbed her this. She's absolutely going to love that. And then the last little gift we got her um is our our generation she loves horses so i thought this was cute it comes with the, you know the little spray bottle and brush and little bucket so i think she's gonna love playing with this and then the last few items and the last few items i got um i found two pompous candles from hearth and hand i did just do a big amazon candle haul so it's not like I really needed these candles at all, but I had one sitting in my cabinet that I was burning in my powder bathroom. If you guys saw my powder bathroom makeover on Wednesday, I posted that. Um, anyways, I was burning this candle and you guys, the smell of this candle is just so freaking good. So I picked up two of these small little pompous candles, one from my bathroom and then one to, you know, just have on hand for when I'm done burning it. <laughs> anyways, that is what I got at Target today. A pretty quick trip. I didn't really go there for home stuff. Um, but yeah, I do love, I do love going to Target. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, thank you for watching this video. If you guys like Target hauls, I will link my most recent Target haul down below that you guys can check out as well. But until next time, I will see you guys later.